Three days left, guys. The countdown is real. And we're playing more jump path because, you know, I gotta get good uh, before the game is out. And this level doesn't allow pretty much anything. I changed from Luigi to uh, whatever this weird Mario sprite is. So we'll see what this level is all about. It's all about spinies, I think. Alright, I can get behind that. That's cool. So we have donut blocks, and then... Oh, shit. I think I need to respawn these guys, because I think I need a spin jump. Yeah, some, some, I need, I need to go off that spiny when he's going on his way back. This is, this is, this shouldn't be that bad. And then we're going to spin. Nice and easy. I should have spin jumped. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I should have figured, but like, when I, at least when I design a level, I put like a blue coin or like a Z or something to indicate the spin jump. And I know that I should have just known that inherently, but it's only indicated like right there with the A. And I should just assume that that's what I should be doing for the whole level. But I guess I'm not that smart and I need the indicator. Nice. All right, spin. No! <laughs> oh my god. All right. I think you just want a small bounce. You don't want a big bounce off the, the first one. I got this shit. That's a consistent setup. That's not bad. It's just this la this next part. Oh yeah, boy. Oh shit. So I guess that's hard if you have a mushroom. Oh, you need a mushroom. Cause you have to get down. Oh shit, so the obstacle. All right. What happened? Um. I just fell. What the hell, where am I? I thought I was dead. Oh, they give you a retry? All right, that's cool. Thank you, God Gamers. Is it, do I get to retry again? Oh, yes, dude, this is perfect. See, like, I was gonna have to do the whole level again, but they were kind of really nice with this retry system right here. That's so stupid. I mean, this works. Kind of, hold up. <laughs> is that cheese? Tell me that was cheese. I think I just cheesed it. I can get behind some cheese. That was really annoying. That section, like I, I had to do it like a, like dozens of times, it feels like. All right, I can get behind this a little bit. I don't mind spending on things. That's, oh shit. <laughs> Went right through the block. All right. Well, this isn't that bad. It's, it's not that bad of a level. Okay, we made it. Damn. How hard is it gotta be? I'm gonna just jump over those boys. I'm not... No! It fell the fuck on me! That is bullshit. That is much better than freaking jumping on them all. Okay, I'm alive. How come I wasn't alive last time? It was because I got hit by the, the bitch. That's annoying. I'm just not gonna spin. I'm just gonna jump over these kids. Oh. That was a pro gamer move. Can I just get out of this level already? Of course I would miss the jump, bro. Of course I would miss it. Why wouldn't I? Easy. All you, that's all I had to do. Okay. What is going on here? Is there enough spinies in this level? What? 
You can't just jump over the damn muncher. Oh my god. Okay. All right, there's the goal. Damn, I was like so close, like so many times, but so much bullshit happened. Like I would miss an easy jump. I would die to something that didn't look like I would die to. All right, not bad overall. We'll see what's happening up next. A bridge level, worn out bridge. Should be really fun, I think. <laughs> We're almost at a boss battle. I wanna get to a boss battle. It's been a while since we've had one. All right. The bridge blocks here are very fragile. Spinning jumping isn't recommended. Okay, I, I get the point. Uh, so like you have to stay moving. Can't, oh, I had to bounce off the Koopa. All right, I get it, I get it. All right. That is cool. Hey, look, they have the pink cloud. Okay, I can't pay attention. They have the pink cloud background like I talked about in my uh, palette video. That's exactly what they're doing. Uh, go. Hey, I like this shit. All right, I'm, I'm, I'm living. Okay, okay, I see, I see you wanna go underneath it. All right, this is cool, I like this shit. This, this is fun and it's fast. It's not like, slow like the other ones. <laughs> I, I really like this level, even though it's gimmicky as hell. It's cool. Alright, I had to take a break because of the annoying church bell, but we are back, gamers. Alright, made it. That's not bad. Okay. Oh, we're, do we're, do we're doing it. Or I was supposed to be doing it, but I didn't. <laughs> All right, we made a lot of progress. I feel like that was really close to the end. When I saw the disco shell, I got scared because those are hard. Okay. All right. Woo hoo! Yeah, boy. <laughs> Shit. There's no way to get the mushroom because we're constantly having to move. This part is really something. Whoa. Saws. Okay. No. Oh god. All right. Spin jumping isn't recommended, it said. How much more of this is- Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> it was going on for a lot longer than I thought. Like, there was a whole other section. I thought, like, after the, the, the two saws, there was going to be more, and then there's, like, a whole little thing. And I'm, like, down to, like, no lives. And now we're on to botanical plant. So this might be a factory level. Uh, I might just game over so I can go back up to 25 lives, and then we'll start the level. All right, botanical plant, let's go. Got our nice little intro screen. I got some hey, hey, hey music. Is that like a Yoshi's Island plant? Uh, I gotta throw it up. Hold up. I think these things can actually hurt you when they break. And I know you can spin on them, so we might want to keep that in mind. Oh shit, all right, I see what's going on. Seems pretty cool. Nice little room to room situation. All right, now they're throwing rocks. I'm gonna come grab this mushroom. So far this level's really easy and pretty fun. Ah, I see what's happening. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it was a simple idea. I just didn't do it effectively. All right, getting the mush and then, hey, nice. Oh, so he's shooting, he's shooting shit. These things can pretty much shoot anything. Dude, is that a disco waffle from SMP3? Our death waffle. Okay. Whoa, it's just, it's spitting saws. Holy shit. We're surfing. 
All right, this is pretty cool. All right. I got hit by the death waffle. This level's pretty sweet so far. I'm, I'm just wondering where the, the checkpoint is. Ooh, got a little survival room. This reminds me of Mario Maker. People usually have survival rooms in there. Oh shit. Nice. All right, that was cool. And we got our juicy checkpoint. Are these jumpable? Can I get up here? Yeah. All right, this is this is really unique. This is dope. They're like spinning platforms up for me. Just gotta avoid these death waffles. All right, dude, this is cool. It's not, it's not a, all right. So you wanna walk between them? All right, cool. Oh, how would you do that? Oh, I think you, oh God, that piranha. What? Oh, the fireball? Where'd it come from? That was <laughs> crazy. <laughs> Gotta go fast. All right. Whoa, okay, I made it. Holy shit, that was cool. All right, just gotta watch out for these fireballs. To be coming out of nowhere. Uh, do I need one of these? Yeah, if I want the mushroom. Oh, I think I needed it to get in there anyway. Do I need this? Do I need the block? I think I do. Shit. Oh yeah, you need it to get through. <laughs> all right, somehow I managed to carry it all the way up. What are these piranha plants doing, man? I know you're in Smash, but hey. Hey, get me up there. So much fire, dude. Oh, all right. That's what I call. All right. Oh shit, they're just like combining everything together. Can I get out of here? Oh, I forgot there's a boss fight. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> this is a very cool boss room, but I suck big time. I like the piranha plants and I like... All right, all right, this, this shouldn't be too bad. It's just windy. Hey. Nice, all right. <laughs> I love the plant theme of that level, that was awesome. That was like proper theming, that was proper evolution of gimmicks, and with multiple gimmicks at once. Some idiots, when in my multiple, in my level design tip, I was like, hey, you should have more than one gimmick. Some people were like, no, that's a stupid idea. That level had way more than one gimmick. It was all around the plant, but the plant would spit out different stuff, such as the platform, such as the blocks. And then when you combine those, it creates more gimmicks, and it was good. If it was just one thing, it could have been boring, but it was awesome. I need to read this. When he's a skillful, skillful gardener. Hey, I didn't know that. Is this, dude, this is adding lore. This is what I'm all about. Garden state? All right, there's still a princess to rescue. Let's keep going. Misty Mountain Pass. I think this is a reference to the Lord of the Rings. All right, let's go. <laughs> Ooh, we got a cool background. The mountain air is filling you with determination. All right, an Undertale reference. And the ability to double jump. Ooh. We can double jump? Oh, shit. All right, so we can't jump, double jump out the water, only from ground. All right, I get it. So we wanna go here and then here, and then we wanna Ooh, that was, that was cool. Can I grab this block? Yeah. Shit, now we gotta go back. All right, that's a little tedious, but at least they're teaching us the mechanic. Okay, we made it. <laughs> Didn't look like we were going to for a second. I'm filled with determination. 
Okay, like, do you have to... Can you fall off and then jump? Yeah, you, you can fall off and then jump. Okay. It's kind of weird when they introduce something that's completely, completely foreign. <laughs> you gotta get used to it, but I think they're giving you ample time to get used to it. Okay, bouncing boy. Where am I going? What? Alright, I think I needed to activate a switch. <laughs> uh, oh, there's an on-off switch down there? Is there a land down here? Oh, there is. Okay. I, I did not see that. I completely just didn't see that. Okay, and I just threw a shell at myself. Okay. Oh, he just dropped a rock on me, dude. <laughs> Alright, that is cool. That is cool as hell. I don't know how I feel about these rocks, though. Okay. I have no idea what's going on now. Oh, did we just lock them in there? <laughs> Get wrecked. Alright, you can't double jump off of enemies. Power up, please. Oh, shit. Oh! I don't even know if I want to go in there. That was like, it was like a death room. Ah, uh, that was scary. I, I might try it, I don't know. Give me that mushroom, yeah. That was scary. Can I get a checkpoint? Probably want to turn that off, I assume. Hey, nice. Where am I going? Okay. Okay. I kind of like the double jump. It's going to be weird when I don't have it anymore. Alright. Give me a power up, please. <laughs> More splitting chucks. A one up, I'll take it. Hey, okay. oh, that was sweet as hell, dude. That was a cool ass level. Really easy, it was kind of confusing at the beginning. I feel like the second half was a lot more straightforward than the beginning, but that was cool. Only took me like a few tries. I think I'll do one more. Oh, dude, what is this? Color a dinosaur? Alright, this sounds fun. What is this all about? This mysterious palace, you can change Gypsy's color, simply drop him into the hole. <laughs> Wait, okay, I need to drop him. Uh. Oh, that was kind of confusing. I, I just want to play Danger Town. Alright, let's go. What's what's up? Oh, it's like a cityscape. That's cool. Oh, and they give me a cape too? Hell yeah. I'm filled with so much determination. I'm having kind of fun with Jump Half today. Yesterday, not so much, but today's level seemed to be a lot cooler and funner. I feel like I know this music. Okay, I just got disco chill. Power ups or just one ups? All right, I can take it. The background's really cool. It kind of reminds me of Celeste's little city level. All right. 
Oh shit. Okay. All right, I can do this. This looks pretty cool, pretty easy. Oh dude, and our yellow switch palace is coming in big handy. But I think you can't even get here if you don't even have the old Switch Palace. Like, you might be able to, but I'm not too sure. This is Mario Kart music. Right? Is this the SNES Rainbow Road? It's If not, it's, it's something Mario Kart. I should have probably gone up there again. It seems very safe. Oh, I stood off too quick. Damn it. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> Alright, gotta watch out. Okay, but this. Alright. Got another disco shell. I think I'm just gonna kill it. Are you, can you not kill disco shells with the cape? That was a bad time to test that idea. Uh, but you can probably bring them down for another secret. I mean, I like the capes that they'd be handing out. I can't complain. The yellow switch really be coming in handy. Okay. Alright, that wasn't good. Oh, oh, I jumped right into it, dude. That was not good. Okay. Gotta try these pipes, you never know what sneaky shit could be. Could be around, could be a checkpoint. Damn it. Oh, maybe we wanna use this shell. Bring it all the way down. Hey, yeah. All right, what's up here? Oh. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. All right, that'll definitely help because I was like, I was too sure that, okay, well I'm just dead now, <laughs> but I was, I was sure that there, that I can't even talk, that the level was too long without one, so at least we found one. Okay. Ooh, good progress. Please let me spin on these things, even though they're kind of hard to do so on. Oh no, what did I just unleash upon myself? A shortcut? Please? Yes. Oh, dude, a three up moon? <laughs> They've incorporated a few disco shells in the last few levels. Please tell me this just lets me go to the end. Oh, it does. <laughs> nice. That level was really tricky towards the end, but the beginning was kind of forgiving. I'm happy I found the checkpoint. Um, and that was a lot of levels. I want to. I actually want to play more. I might do another video. I I can't confirm or deny that, but pretty cool. Brothers in Arms. Me and Yoshi. Even though I'll probably dump them off. Um, but I'll see you guys in Mario Maker 2 in just a few days' time.